So Eternal Squad, I hope y'all can hear me. This is something new. I'm like, why not try it? You feel me? So y'all see by today's title, I'm talking about how the reason, oh, the reason you can't remember your dreams, or the reason you don't dream. And I'm gonna teach y'all how to remember y'all dreams, and I'm gonna teach y'all how to dream in lucid dream. I'm gonna teach y'all how to lucid dream. Yeah. So I hope everything. I hope everything is good. So if y'all catch me looking over here, I'm trying to make sure everything good because the camera's up there. You feel me? But the reason you don't remember your dreams is because you are sleeping the wrong way. That could be one reason you can't remember your dreams because you are sleeping the wrong way. You may be uncomfortable when you sleep. You may move around when you sleep. It all depends how you sleep. See me, I had a out of body experience while I was dreaming. Yes, while I was dreaming last night. This happened last night. This happened to me last night. So when I was sleeping, I slept on the floor. And the way I slept on the floor, I slept on the floor like my back just laying down. My back laying down, and I'm looking towards the wall. I'm looking up there. I'm looking up there while my back laying down. Do y'all get the vision? Do you get the vision? So I'm just I'm laying on my back and I'm looking at the ceiling. And once I'm laying on my back and looking at the ceiling, I'm paying attention up here. I'm I'm, I'm, put, I'm putting all my attention towards my third eye. I'm putting all my attention, all my attention towards my crown chakra and my third eye. All my attention. I'm paying attention to my thoughts. This is how you really. Have an out of body experience dreaming. You have to really understand, understand that you are not the body. So I had a, I tricked my mind into thinking that I am not the body. Even I'm not, we are not the body, but I tricked my mind to thinking that I'm not the body. So when I tricked my mind to thinking that I'm not the body, I had an out of body experience while dreaming, lucid dream. I turned on a frequency. It was a frequency. I turned on the frequency and it said lucid dream. I'm like, okay, let me try this frequencies. I end up saying, because when at, at nighttime, at nighttime, that's when the universe is up at nighttime. Don't lose me now. At nighttime, the universe is up between three, the between three and five, five a.m., two, one, twelve. The universe is up. When I say the universe is up, you are getting downloads, and you are getting you are getting a lot of downloads. So you may not understand it now; it may confuse you now. But sooner and later in life, you're gonna understand what I'm saying. So I'm laying on my back. I got some frequencies on. I got frequencies on every time I go to sleep at night for protection and so I can really communicate with the universe. You know what I'm saying? Because the universe, I'm I get deep on this, but uh, don't lose me now. Because I feel like I'm losing myself. I got to slow down. So I tricked my mind to thinking I'm not the body. I'm observing my thoughts. I'm paying attention to how I feel. The more I observe my thoughts, is the more I am watching my thoughts. Like I'm watching my thoughts. When you observe your thoughts, you are watching your thoughts. And the more you get into that meditation state, it's like your thoughts become pictures. Listen to what I'm saying. The more you get into that meditation state and the more your body is comfortable, it's like your thoughts become movies. It's like you can see your thoughts. It's like you can see. Your thoughts, like, let's say, for example, you think of a horse. You're going to see that horse. And you might see someone on that horse. And that someone on that horse might be you. You feel me? So I'm just letting my mind wander. You got to let your mind wander if you really want to have dreams. Like, you really want to have lucid dreams? You got to set an attention. Like you gotta really set attention when you go to sleep. What do you want to get out of this this rest? Like, what type of feeling do you want to get out this rest when you wake up? How do you want to feel when you wake up? 
I'm saying, do you, like, don't you want your body to be, like, good? Like, not crampy? Because we not supposed to sleep on beds. You know what I'm saying? We not supposed to sleep on beds. It's man-made. We supposed to sleep on the floor. We supposed to be sleeping outside. You know what I'm saying? So, dang. So, I realized when I was sleeping, I wasn't sleeping. I was conscious that I was still awake because I tricked my mind to thinking I'm not the body. So I was still conscious that I was still awake, but my, my body is asleep. You know I'm saying that's when your soul start, your soul start to wander. Like your soul leave your body when you go to sleep, when you take rest. Your soul wanders off. It goes somewhere else. When I say your soul goes somewhere else, your spirit goes somewhere else, it goes somewhere else. This is not the real world. This is not the real world. You got to understand this. When we go to sleep, we are somewhere else. We are somebody else. We probably may be an animal. We probably may be a tree. We probably may be grass. We, we are something else. We are something else. We are not this avatar. This is this is just a avatar. This is just a character in the Matrix. But this is how the matrix the matrix really works. This is how it really works. When you can, when you can really, this is how the matrix really work. I'm gonna break it down to y'all. It's when you can really use your imagination. That's how you unlock the matrix. You gotta use your imagination. Some people call it delusional. But it's not delusional when you can use your imagination in your world. You are the co-creator of your reality. The, rea the reality that you are currently experiencing, you are the co-creator. You are God. God is conscious. You know what I'm saying? God is conscious. So the more your conscious rises, is the more you're going to know your life on a deeper level. I don't want y'all to lose me now. I don't want y'all to lose me. I don't want y'all to lose me. But basically in the lucid dream, in the in the dream I had, that I was I was a animal. I was grass. I began to understand who I am. During that lucid dream, I got a lot of information. During that lucid dream, I began to understand that we are not the body. During that lucid dream, I understand that when we go to sleep, we're not really sleeping. We are living separate lives, to totally different lives when we are sleeping. This is the matrix. This is a simulation. The matrix will come to a crumble. The demons that run this world, is they going to be going to destroy them. Our ancestors are shooting back down to earth. You feel me? The more that, that sun, that more the sun rises every single day, is the more people are going to awake. They're going to remember who they are. They're going to start digging in their subconscious. They're going to start having no dreams again. They're going to start having memory. They're going to remember, really remember who they are and who they was. So another thing, another thing, the reason you are not dreaming is because your diet, what, what you eat. If you eat bullshit before going to sleep, you 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 not gonna get you not gonna even be sleeping. Your body going your body's doing extra work to get that bullshit out your system. So, if you want to dream and you want to remember your dreams, don't eat nothing past eight o'clock. Don't eat nothing. Go go to sleep on an empty stomach. Go to sleep on an empty stomach because your dreams are very important. Your dreams is going to get you the, the answers to all your problems. It's, it's going to get you the answers to people's problems. You feel me? Your dreams are signs. Your dreams are messages. Your dreams are past life experiences. So you may have a dream where you probably jumped off a building. It's because you probably jumped off a building in your past life. 
You got more than one past life. You have more than one soul. So when you meet people and you, it's like an instant connection, that's that's a person. That's a person that that's, y'all recognize each other. Y'all soul recognize each other. Y'all, y'all travel. Y'all, y'all landing on earth with each other. You know what I'm saying? Like twin flames. Y'all souls were, was created with each other before y'all was sent and landed here. It may confuse you. It may have your mind wondering. But the more you really focus on yourself and tap in with yourself, meditate, go outside and ground yourself, sun gaze is the more you won't really unlock something within you. This world is spiritual. This is a spiritual world. This is a spiritual world. I'm saying this is a spiritual world. Everything is an illusion. Everything is divine conscious timing. We are we are connected in the conscious, but we are not the same. Everybody is not the same. I'm saying when we speak, when we speak our messages, when we speak what's on our heart, when we speak what's on our mind, that's not us speaking. That's the ancestors working through us. That's the ancestors speaking through us. Because we are our and we are our ancestors. We are God. God lives within us. God, He us, He's conscious. So when people trust a Bible more than they trust a show self, it just showing that they are they 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 disrespecting their ancestors. They they disrespecting the people that really brought them here. I'm saying when you trust when you trust a God outside of yourself, you are disrespecting your ancestors. You are disrespecting the ones that created you. That Bible can't teach you. You about yourself. That Bible can't teach you about yourself. But outside can, that grass can, that sun can, they don't want us to connect with the sun. They don't want us to be outside. Because once we begin to go outside, we are really tapping in. When you are tapping in with yourself, you're gonna have your dreams. When you can where you can move around, you can see. That's crazy. In the lucid dream, I was able to move around. I was able to move around, like I was able to really control everything. And I got too excited. And, and, and I end up snapping back into my body. I end up going back to my body because I got too excited. You got to keep calm when you're having those lucid dreams. I'm saying we 13 minutes in, y'all. Just stay calm when you're having those lucid dreams. If you're having a lucid dream and you're able to move in your dream, you're able to, you're able to control your dream, stay calm. Because the more you get excited is the more you're going to snap out of it. I'm telling you, you can do anything. You can fly. You can fly. You, you can really fly, bro. You can go through walls. You have spiritual superpowers. You have spiritual intelligence. You can see the future. I'm saying? Why you think? Some spiritual creators predicted something and it happened. It's because they was going within. They was connected with outside. They was they, they are connected. They are in tune with the universe. You know what I'm saying they are in tune with the universe. But this is what you got to understand about these platforms. These people run these platforms. So when you got status. And when you got a influence, when you can say something and it and it and it and it, and it sparks something within somebody, those people are gonna come after you. This is their platform, this is their shit. You know what I'm saying, but we are protected. We are protected, divinely protected. We are here for a purpose, we are destined for greatness. 
So no matter what anybody say, they can't take it away from you. They can't take what you know away from you. You may know somebody more than they know they self. Listen to what I just said. You may know somebody more than they know they self. Because you did the work. When I say you did the work, you cut it, you cut people off. You cut you, you moved on like that that shit that hurt you, that shit you that shit you was hurt from. You you don't even go, you don't even remember that shit no more. You you forgot about that. You like, oh, that happened. Man, I healed from that shit. You healed yourself. You understanding yourself. You, you taking the time to really be bored with yourself. You are doing new things. You are investing in yourself. You are really determined to succeed. You are way ahead of your time. When you look around, you know it's energy all around you. A lot of people not gonna understand what the fuck I'm saying, and that's and that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? They gonna they gonna they gonna call you crazy. It's because you know yourself. You you got principles and morals. You you don't give a fuck about the trance. Cause that train gonna lead you to a dead end. Straight facts. You know what I'm saying one the one thing about this social media platform you gotta understand. No matter how big you get, no matter how many, no matter how many subscribers you get, no matter how many cars money you get, you can't run away from that feeling you get when you sleep at night. That feeling you get at nighttime, you can't run away from that feeling. That feeling that you are experiencing is there for you. Your demons is there for you. Angels are there for you. God is going to redirect you. So you can get to know you and, and who God is. They can say God is Jesus, God is Allah all they want. But you will know the truth. Once you begin to really build a relationship with yourself. I just want y'all to understand that this shit do not matter at all. No matter what you believe in, believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. When you feel like you're the only one that understands you, you are in a position to win. Because it's somebody out there feels like everybody understands them. Like, come on, now it's somebody out there that's really around a bunch of people that don't give a fuck about them. So, life Will be, will begin to make sense. 2020, 2024, life will start to begin to make sense for a lot of people. The news is fake. You got to understand this. The news is fake as fuck. It's a stage. This is a world stage. This is a world stage. They, 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 they strip things. They... They make it look good. They make it sound crazy. Like the top, like the top. Like you ever heard the top craziest things you heard on the news? The top craziest things. It could be a school shooting. It can be, it could be any, it could be anything that's that seen out of this world. That stuff be scripted. That stuff was planned. It. They planned everything to keep us in fear at a low vibration. That's why they that's why it's green lights and red lights on every street. They controlling the frequency, they controlling the energy, the energy flow. Everything is energy. Energy never die. You can't destroy energy. You can't make it. But 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 magic. Come on now. Magic. We is magic. They can't fuck with us. When I say we is magic, we is magic. Those Caucasians, those retel the reptilians and shit, they can't, they can't tap into that shit how we can tap into that shit. You know what I'm saying? They try to mimic us. They try to mock us. They took everything away from us. And a lot of people, they are afraid to speak up because they are afraid of what's going to happen to them. 
Nothing's going to happen to you. Nothing. Nothing. Don't allow nobody to, to stop you from talking your truth, speaking your truth. That's your purpose. That may be your purpose. Your purpose is right in front of your face. You create your purpose. You create your own destiny. You create your own path. It's what you what you want to do, what you really want to do. Because nine times out of ten, the th that thing you really want to do, nobody hasn't done it before. There's no limits. Stop being around people that has limits. When you're a person that has no limits and you think highly of yourself and you think what you are doing is going to be great and the best thing to ever exist, Oh my gosh. They don't like that. Because they have they have a cap. You gotta understand in this world is there's no cap, there's no box. There's none of that. It's just like really it's simple math. It's simple, it's simple math. It's simple, it's really simple math when you understand the math they teach us in school. It's not the correct math. School. School. A school is probably the, the one of the worst things they can ever put a child through. First round, if you're in high school, you're around people that really, you don't even know them. Like, you don't even know who they really are. You don't even know their upbringing. You don't even know what the fuck they are doing outside of school. So, you are around all this energy. You are around all this negative, demonic-ass energy. And when you are a high vibrational person in school, you are a fucking star. You know what I'm saying? They know you a star. They know who you are. They know your last name, your first name, your middle name. They know you. Because you are the orb. You, they, you, gotta, you know what I'm saying? You are, you are a walking fucking... You are a rainbow, my nigga. You got all the colors to the aura. You know I'm saying... They they took they took the they took the aura and turned that shit into some demonic. They made that shit LGTB. What the fuck is called? What the fuck is called? They made that into something to support the gays. I'm saying they taking our shit. We not supposed to live like that. We not supposed to. People like me is here to really. Help those people. I'm not here to judge nobody. I don't even I don't know your story. You know what I'm saying? You can't judge no one if you don't know their story. You know what I'm saying? What that person probably went through, I probably would have gave up. So I'm I, I'm I appreciate my trials and tribulations through life because it made me the person I am today. We are not the same, we are different in, in our own ways. But this video about 23 minutes long, bro. Shit, let's fucking make it 30. Let's make it 30. We already talking. We already talking. It's like when I talk, y'all, I don't really have the intentions. I just let my higher self speak for me. Because I know what I'm saying right now, it can meet you, it can reach millions of people. I know the, the people out there, the masses need to hear this. The masses need to hear this. You are powerful. You are powerful. That idea that sits on your mind. That 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 word of truth that sits on the top of your tongue. You got to speak that. You don't. You 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 would be surprised. How your words influence people. You'd be surprised how many people actually look up to you. You'd be surprised how many people wait for you to drop a video. Wait for you to come outside. Like You'd be surprised how much the impact your energy brings to the table. Your energy, you have to protect. You have no enemies. You are, you, you are your number one enemy. They can't fuck with you. Even if they try. Some people, they go try they, they try to fuck with you, but they don't even know what they're getting themselves into. You talking about spiritual rank. 
A lot of people don't got spiritual rank. When you got spiritual, when you got rank in the spiritual, it's physical shit. You can destroy all the shit if you want to by a snap of a finger. So I love I, I love Eternal Squad. I just hope whatever I said in this video really helped you in some type of shape or way or form. I don't make these videos to put fear in nobody's heart. I don't I don't make these videos to change anybody's perspective on life. Live your life how you want to live your life. Do what you feel called. Do what you feel called to do. Do what bring do what brings your, your soul joy. And stay consistent at it. Stay focused on your soul. I don't make these videos for nobody but myself and my ancestors. Because I know they are working through me right now. They are really guiding me in the right direction to reaching more people all around the world that are just like me. So no matter what you believe in, no matter what you was taught, it doesn't matter at the end of the day. It doesn't matter. Because one day we, 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 we will leave this earth. One day we will leave. There's nothing, none of this shit matters. So if you are worried about another person, another man, another woman, I don't know what the fuck to say to you. If you are worried about another man, especially, you must be attracted to him. It's that simple, my nigga. If you are worried about another woman, you must be attracted to him. You must like women. You must like men. Feel me? But it shouldn't be like that. Everything should be love, unconditionally. Even, even when you don't love me, I still love you. <laughs> you feel me? That's, that's, that's what makes us different. But, you tell the squad, I know I was talking a lot. But I know my true supporters, they're going to watch this video. And they 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 gonna love this shit. And right now we are currently at like let me check my subscriber count. We let me check my subscriber count. Yeah, I got y'all, bro. My head looking crazy, bro. Y'all see that in the background? Live the live the life you imagine. You can do anything in this world. You can have anything in this world, bro. Look at this stuff, bro. So right now I got hello. I love you. My bad. My bad. My bad. My guy. My bad. My guy. Shit. Focus. Fuck. I wish I had a better camera. <laughs> but I got two thousand and four hundred and like forty four subscribers, bro. In twenty twenty four. So whenever you watch this video, use this as inspiration. You don't need inspiration from nobody. You don't need to look up to nobody. You is him. You is you is her. So look look for your look for yourself in the room full of people that are wearing masks. Look for yourself. When I say look for yourself, look for your reflection. Look for the reflect. Look for your reflection, like the person that really looks like you, talks like you. Match your vibe, match your energy. Look for that person in the room full of people that are wearing masks. Simple. Be be hell. Hey, 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 I gotta get my watch time on this shit. Shit, we already at we already at 28 minutes. Why not make it 30? But 30, but if y'all know you're OG supporter, OG subscriber, y'all know this came a long way. So whenever y'all seeing this box in the future, I hope I still got it. And we got the vision board right here, y'all. We got the vision board, y'all. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Yeah, a lot is on this vision board. I made it. I made it last year, and I started adding a couple, like a couple words on it, like this year and last year. I know y'all probably don't care, but shit, get you a vision board. Uh, believe in yourself, love unconditionally, uh, meditate. Uh, get the answers from, for yourself. You got this information. I'm not the only one that got this information. And my name is AC Lucky. That's just a that's just a character in the Matrix. And shit. Um. Uh. 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 uh two. Three. <laughs> four. Five. Six. Seven.
All right. I love you, man.